The two sort of major things I would stress about multi-practice CLE, the most successful use of this is when you are delivering it to a single client organization. So not one person, you can invite multiple people at the same client, obviously, but one client organization. And the reason for that is clients do not want to learn about new legal issues. They really don't care. They want to know how that new legal issue is going to impact their business and what they need to be doing about it. So the more that you can construct the CLA around teaching them how to react and what they need to be doing to their company specifically, the more value they're going to get out of that event. Multi-practice, that's also super important in order to be able to deliver on this. Your clients are not looking at their business in terms of practice silos. They are just running a business. And so if, say, let's, for example, we have a client who's in real estate and they've got a real estate transaction coming up. Well, real estate is just one thing. So having only the real estate attorney there is not as helpful as if you had, say, the tax attorney, maybe the finance attorney, maybe even a transactions attorney, because all those things play into a real estate transaction. And your client will at some point have a question that probably overlaps, and the last thing you want is the real estate attorney say, well, I don't really know much about tax, but I'll make sure to get so-and-so in touch with you. Have that person there ready to answer the question on the spot for the client as well.